Today's project is to turn this Alien 560 quadcopter into an X8 octocopter. I've got the extra motors, I've bought some more ESCs, I've got the extra plates for the FY680 frame motor mounts so we can have motors on the bottom and top. I'm going to use these S500 landing legs. We'll make a start. So I'm just attaching my landing legs like so. I've got these fastening hardware, these rubber grommets, but I really wanted these screws with the, uh, the lock nuts. These little knock lock nuts to put it on. They're all from Hobby King. So that's going to be the new landing gear. So these are my Taro FY. 680 motor mounts and as you can see you can mount motors top bottom as in there he is so that's what it will look like when it's all done here we have it all wired up we've got our ESCs wiring loom so here it is complete Alien 560 FY680 Tarot motor mounts, motors top and bottom, for an X8 quad. A bit dark outside now, so we'll take it out tomorrow and see how she flies. Hopefully, it'll be good. Is this a new bed? Hey? The double rotors. We need to tone down the tip scale in here. Actually, when you're turning it, you can see how slow the props go. Yeah. It really slows them down, doesn't it? Yeah. See, look how slow they are. Yeah, the top one. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it looked like the bottom ones were spinning pretty much flat out the whole time, but whenever, whenever you're doing any rotation, it looked like the top ones were like barely spinning. And, and uh, when you start rotating, it goes a bit out of control, so I don't yeah. think the KK2 is designed very well for an X8. So yeah. it was losing, it was actually losing um, rudder every now and then. Oh really? Yeah. Yeah. 